thumbnail is one of the best way to get your video ranking thumbnail helps you to get more views and more visibility on the youtube algorithm so today i'll be taking you on the steps on how you can create the perfect thumbnail easy fast and free <laughs> My name is Ike Nasika and this is Tech Impact. If you're a new member here, can you make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel? Turn the bell notification to be notified whenever we post our free videos. So today I'll be showing you how you can create a perfect custom thumbnail that can help you generate more views and more subscribers to your YouTube channel. Or you can be able to apply custom thumbnail to your YouTube videos or your previous YouTube videos, your channel must be verified. If you want to verify your YouTube channel, the link will be posted in the description or you can click on the card right now to go and know how to verify your YouTube channel. So once you have to verify your YouTube channel, you are ready to start using a custom thumbnail on your YouTube videos. So the custom thumbnail will help you to generate more views on your YouTube videos and more subscribers on your YouTube channel. So the first thing you do is you take a pictures of the thumbnail, what your video is all about. You can take it while you're shooting or after you're shooting or you can screenshot in the video but I prefer you take a picture of when you are shooting the video. After you've taken the pictures or screenshot of the videos or picture that you want to use, you might want to head to remove.bg. Remove.bg is a place where you can remove the background automatically from the picture so we're gonna head into there and start this video i'll be taking the picture or a pose which i'll be using for this video so let's start taking the pose after you've done removing the background the next thing you do is you head into canva canva is a free place where you can get your thumbnail you can get your artwork, you can get your posters, you can get a lot of things. You can even get your intros on your YouTube channel from Canva. Canva is a place where you can get a full package, free goodies and many more. So we're going to head into Canva and we're going to start making our YouTube terms. Though. So let's go in and start this video. You stick around. This is the remove.bg. So what you need to do here is your upload image which you want to use for the thumbnail. So I'm going to select the image by clicking on upload image. Right here you can select you want to take a picture or you want to go with your browser. Your browser is a place where you can select the picture which you have taken. So I'm going to be selecting that picture which I took while making this video. Okay now I've selected the picture and it's uploading as you can see now it's And you, as you can see here, the upload is done. So all you have to do is you download the up, the image which you have selected. But um, this image that I took was not quite beautiful, so I'll be using another image for this video. So now this is the picture I'll be using. Now that I've removed the background, let's go into Canva. Sign up. Under your sign in, you will type in custom thumbnail as you can see now so you can see they have many um, free thumbnail which you can use for your videos but in this video we'll be creating a thumbnail from scratch so you click on the blank box so I'm gonna cancel this just cancel it so as you can see here is pure white and there is nothing here and we are going to start from the scratch. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to duplicate this. So this is the first one and this is the second one right here. So this second one, I will be bringing the picture which I have removed the background into this place by clicking in the plus sign. If you are on your desktop, this plus sign might be at the right side. You can't see it on your desktop. You can just see upload. So, because I'm using a mobile device, you can go to click on the plus sign, go to upload, and select upload file. Go to your device, select the file. Now, I already I already have this app. So, what I'm gonna do is just go back. So then click on the picture 
so you know that this was the picture that we removed the background so i'm gonna place it somewhere here and get a good paste about it like it a little more down up and down bring it down a bit so bring it down and bring it down and bring it down adjustments down okay this looks perfect yeah so you can see now so i'm just gonna add another layer which is the third one you can see the second one and this is the third one so i'm just gonna click on the background click on the plus sign go to background and once you're doing your thumbnail you have to select a good color that could bring people to click to your video so I'm going to look for a better color that is very attractive which is the one of the most important things you need to look into when you're creating your own custom thumbnail so let's look for a color so I'm gonna take this yellow color here looks more attractive with the shine with the stars in it so I'm going to be using it. So what I'm going to do now is I add another page. You can see the third page there and this is the fourth one. So in this fourth one, I'm bringing, I'll be duplicating this picture which you see here. I'll be making it look too. So I'm going to click on that plus sign and go to upload again. And click on that picture which I'm using. So this picture, I'm going to be using it in this, in this tutorial as well. Okay, just adjust it more and um, okay, alright, just a little bit more. So I'm just gonna adjust this picture out now and I'm gonna add so I'm gonna add another page which is maybe page five. So what you're going to do here now is you're going to try to add some effects the brightness on this one. So I'm going to head to adjust. So once you get to adjust, I'm gonna increase the brightness to the highest, which is 100. The contrast as well to 100. Okay, let's make some little adjustments can be necessary or not will not be necessary but um, blow I don't think I need blow so I'm just gonna reduce it and, uh, so this is what I'm gonna put it to the end Save it and uh, so the next thing I will go to do now will go to position and I can just tap on the picture that I want to use. So I'm just gonna tap it, I'm gonna put it on backward, put it on backward, make it go to the back while the one comes out. So as you can see now, this that's going to back. So what I'm gonna do is just adjust it to give it that great layer. thing we're going to do is put title to the thumbnail. So we're going to add the page and click on the plus sign. And click on text. So we're going to select the best text which I normally use, which is best I will tell you. So this is the one of the best. This one of the best. Is mostly your picture, is mostly to be a picture, so you, you just 
I'm gonna add too many words to it. Just the keywords that will grab your audience to click into your video. So you don't wanna put too much letters into it. So I'm just gonna adjust this. gonna do now is you download the image by clicking on the download button at the right top corner click on download so I'm downloading for image the seven images so it's going to be downloading on zip file so once I'm done I'm going to select this last one that I did so guys thank you for watching if this video was helpful kindly make sure you subscribe to my youtube channel turn on the bell notification to be notified when I post my free videos and let me know in the comment below what you think about this video was it helpful? Which video did you use to make? Let me know in the comment below and show make more 